He's God. He's God. He is God. He alone is God. He alone is God. Oh, Rama, Mama, 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 we thank you and we bless you in Jesus name and everybody said amen let us go straight into the scriptures Malachi chapter 2 are you excited to be in church this morning expect a miracle today you didn't hear me expect a miracle today Expect your healing today. Yes. Expect a prophecy that you are waiting for today. Yes. For it will happen. Jesus said, Fear not, little flock, for it is your Father's good pleasure to give you the kingdom. Fear not, little flock, Jesus, why should we not fear? Don't be afraid. Why? Because it is your Father's good pleasure. How many of you believe that you have a Heavenly Father? And you know that you have a Heavenly Father. Yes. You are the one that Jesus is speaking to. Don't be afraid. For your Father's good pleasure is to give you the kingdom. In other words, whatever is in the kingdom of God, because you are a little flock, when you ask, it will be given to you. And the Bible tells us that the kingdom of God is not meat. It is not drink. But what is the kingdom of God? It is righteousness. It is peace and joy in the Holy Ghost. This morning, I want to announce to you that wherever your joy has been arrested and sent to, your joy is coming back. I said your joy is coming back. And whoever stole your peace, your peace is coming back. Amen. Hallelujah, somebody. Fear not, little flock. It is your father's good pleasure to give you the kingdom. This morning, Malachi 2 verse 1. Shando rabaka, shando rabayataya. The Bible says, And now, O ye priests, this commandment is for you. What is the commandment? If ye will hear, if ye will not hear, and if ye will not lay it to heart. Now if I look at this, to give glory unto my name. There is nothing God is expecting you to do this morning than to tell him, Lord, I give you thanks. All the glory belongs to you. You know, Saturdays in Ghana are days where many people are being buried. Every cemetery is busy on Saturdays. Maybe you, went, you even went for someone's funeral, but you were not the one being lowered into the grave. And it has not crossed your mind that glory to God or to give thanks to God. Don't only give thanks to God when you get grade A in a course. No. Give glory to God for everything that he has done for you. The Bible says, to give glory unto my name, saith the Lord of hosts. If you don't do it, what will I do to you? I will send a curse upon you. And I will curse your blessings. And I've cursed them already. Because ye do not. Church, this morning, I need us all to be grateful and thankful to God for what he has done for us. God has done so many things for us. He's kept us safe and sound. He's given us a sound mind. But I need us to give glory to God. So just lift your two hands with me to heaven, wherever you may be standing. And let thanksgiving in words come out of your mouth. And let them ascend to the Lord, the Lord of hosts, the King of kings, the Alpha and Omega. Lift your voice and give him thanks. Lift your voice and give him thanks. Lift your voice and give him thanks. 
Lift your voice and give him thanks. If you will not give me glory, I will send a curse upon your blessing. The Lord, forgive us and receive our thanksgiving this morning. Lift your hands and lift your voice and say thank you to God. I may not know what you want to thank God for, but I know there are so many things that he has done for you and he has done for me. Lift your voice and give him thanks. Give God thanks for your marriage. Give God thanks for your relationship. Give God thanks for your family. Give God thanks for your business. Give God thanks for your academics. Give him thanks. Give him thanks. Wherever you may be standing, I need you to raise your voice and say thank you to God. Go ahead and pray somebody.
give him thanks. Give him thanks. Jesus. Jesus. amazing now I want us to pray this morning we are giving thanks to God we are thanking God anytime you thank God you cause him to do what he has done already for you again anytime you say thank you to somebody who gives you something what you don't know is that the person is moved to do or give you that same thing again because you appreciated what the person gave to you. Hallelujah. Now, the Bible says that we are kept by the power of God. 
which means for us to be alive, it is because of the power of God. You know, the Bible says that the kingdom of God is not just word, but also power. Power is part of the kingdom of God. And God has kept us by power. That is why we are still alive. Are you here with me? You know, this week, I was walking, going somewhere, and God brought an old thing to memory. This was a woman who used to help me go to school some time ago, before I came to the university. And even when I came, she used to give me money sometimes to come. But one day I was in the math class, and then her son texted me that my, my, my mother is dead. And I, I, I felt so sad. And anytime I walk, that, that woman's memory comes to mind. Like, this woman is gone. This woman is gone. This woman is gone. But you are still alive. You know? No one is alive because of where they are. Or who is protecting them. Or the family that they are coming from. But we are all alive. Including even wicked people. They are all alive because they don't know. They are all alive because of the power of God. So I need you to be grateful and thankful to God for the power that he released. If God should take his power, that keeps you from living. If he should take it away, you'll be the next one to be in the grave on Saturday. Maybe yours will even be during the week. How many want God to take away that power? No. How many of you want God to keep that power? Yes. So this morning, I want us to be grateful again and thankful to God. Let us thank God for the power that he has given us, which is keeping us alive. Which is keeping us alive. Lift your hands to God. Let's thank God for life. Thank God for life. It is supernatural to be alive. It is a miracle to be alive. You fly from country to country and you are alive. You drive from one region to another region and you are still alive. Know that it is the power of God that has kept you up to this day. It's not the devil's power. <laughs> he even has no power. It is God's power. And this morning I need you to raise your voice. And raise your hands and have something to tell God. Thank God for their power. Yes. 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 Satan is looking for you and looking for me earnestly and seriously to kill us. But we are kept by the power of God. We are kept by the omnipotent. We are kept by the miraculous power of God. Give him thanks for that power. You don't know what you are going through. If you know the blessings that God has arranged for you, you will lift your hands and close your eyes and say, Lord, I thank you for my life. I thank you for my life. I thank you for my life. Go ahead and give God thanks. Go ahead and give God thanks. Go ahead and give God thanks. Yes. You have a sound mind. Your eyes are working. Your eyes can work. Your hands can move. Your brain is working. Hey, don't take it lightly. We did not come here to take God lightly. We came to give glory to God. Come on, go ahead and give him thanks. It's well said that if you don't give me that glory, I will send a curse. I will send a curse. But we don't need that curse, Lord. We don't want that curse, Lord. Therefore, Lord, we will give you thanks. 
We will give you thanks. We will give you thanks. We will give you thanks. We will give you thanks. Your children are alive, not because of what you give them to eat. They are kept also by the power of God. Shadia katora bakataya. Shadia karabo kotari adabaya. Zemere kobo shataya baya. Come on, go ahead and give God thanks. Go ahead and give God thanks. We are thanking God this morning. There are many wonders in thanksgiving. There are many wonders in thanksgiving. There are many wonders in thanksgiving. Sharia koraka pashataya. Hey. Jesus. Jesus, we thank you. Jesus, we thank you. Jesus, we thank you. You are the life. You are life. You are the life. Because of you, we are alive. We give you praise. We give you thanks. We thank you. In Jesus' name. Lift your hands to the Almighty One and close your eyes. I need you. Many of you are just looking around. I don't know what you're expecting, but close your eyes and lift your hands for us to be gathered this morning. Lift it high. Jesus. 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 Though we can't see you, we know that you are here. Ha Rama Nama 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 Nama. Shadia kora bakata rika bashanda bakata ya Zora baya kaya shanda la baya baya We give you glory Lord As we honor you At our prayer Lord We give you glory Lord As we honor you For you As we honor you, no one else, Lord. We give you glory, Lord. As we honor, as we honor you, you are, you are wonderful. Raise your hands and raise your voice and sing this to worship the Lord. This morning, as old as you are, he never changes. You remain the same, ancient of days, ancient of days. As old as, as old as you are, oh, as old as you are, you remain, you remain the same. Oh, ancient of days, ancient of days. As old as you are. Sing it to the Lord. 